Hey, I'm Cayman and I'm with Fleetio and I'm gonna give you a quick overview of our platform today. When you log into Fleetio, you're gonna start out on your dashboard. Your dashboard is your 30,000 foot view from above that's gonna give you really valuable information such as open issues, overdue service reminders, on-time service compliance, fleet costs, and more. This is where fleet managers and other folks that have a hand in the fleet are gonna be able to plan and execute their day out. Moving on to our vehicle list, this is gonna serve as your digital filing cabinet for your fleet. In your vehicle list, you can filter down based off of the asset type, the group that it belongs to, the status, and many other filters. Just like all lists in Fleetio, this is gonna be highly configurable. So you can take the columns that you see here and you can add them, you can remove them so that you're seeing the information that's most valuable to you for your vehicle list. Now we're gonna click into a vehicle and see some of the information that's here. This is the vehicle overview page. The vehicle overview page has a ton of valuable information and it's essentially gonna house everything from acquisition to disposal all in one location. Here you're gonna be able to see any issues for a vehicle that are overdue, service reminders that are coming up, work orders that need to be completed, and you can also get a snapshot of what your total cost of ownership is for a particular asset. Just like everything else in Fleetio, this page is gonna be fully customizable. So here you can jump straight into your service history, your inspection history, your issues, fuel, and many other aspects. What's great about Fleetio is you have unlimited data storage, so you're gonna be able to upload documents, files, and anything that's pertinent to your fleet all within one location. Moving on to inspections. Fleetio offers a mobile app that's available on Android and iOS, and it's gonna allow you and your users to submit inspections, issues, and a lot of other really valuable information straight from the field. With Fleetio's mobile inspections, you're gonna be able to capture all of the important information such as condition checks, tires, lights, and other things that are important to making sure your vehicles are in tip-top shape. Fleetio's inspections are also gonna geotag where the inspection was submitted so you can see exactly where your operators were whenever they completed that inspection. We also have the ability to create issues and assign other workflows right within our inspection form so that you minimize data entry and manual actions and can spend more time focusing on your fleet. Bringing things home, we're gonna take a look at reports. Fleetio offers over 41 standard reports that can all be customized and is gonna put the most valuable information right at your fingertips. Let's take a look at our operating cost summary report. The operating cost summary report is gonna compile your service cost, fuel cost, and other expenses all in one centralized report. Here you're gonna be able to see a breakdown of what your average cost per meter is, what your categorical breakdown is for your spend, and then also a total cost spend for a certain time period. With all reports in Fleetio, they're 100% customizable. That means that you're gonna be able to filter down to specific information such as vehicle groups, status, vehicle type, and more. And just like everything else in Fleetio, you can customize the columns. So if there are any custom fields or data points that you wanna see on that report, they can be added in right away. Lastly, on reports, you have the ability to print those out as PDFs, export them as a CSV file, or what most people like to do is save and schedule reports. That way you can build the report that you want and then have it sent to your inbox automatically without any additional work. To get a full view of everything that Fleetio can do for your fleet, go to fleetio.com demo and schedule time with one of our sales reps now.